everyone. <clears throat> Welcome to Roger Paul channel. Planet X number update today. Folks, as you can tell, it's sunset and this is the east. Look at that, right in here. Check out this. That's a cutoff right there. And then look, looks like something smoked across the sky. Right here. Take a look. Yeah, like it starts over here in the southwest and then comes over. Be there. And there's the east. Uh, roughly about 20 minutes ago. Folks, this uh, um, Neveru Planet X, it's doing, the system's doing something weird. Right in here, I had seen clouds that I've never seen before. And they was blue about 20 minutes ago. Right now, it's like 9.02. So, <clears throat> I think it was like 9.49, I mean, I'm sorry, 8.48, Ohio, you know, Ohio time, Eastern Daylight Time. And it, it was like somebody got a, like, uh, cornflakes, you know, say they're blue. And you just throw them up in the sky and they stuck there. That's what it looked like up there. Look at this. Look at that right there. That's glowing right there. That's the south. So that's the east. There's the north. Let's go look at the west. Look at this. It's starting to get pretty good right now, so let's go check out the west. And uh, I noticed that uh, they may have found for the first time another solar system that can fit well that will that can fit in between our sun and earth but it's a seven i think it's a seven planet mini solar system so isn't that something now this here now uh from past videos folks i mean seriously all kidding aside, large object sets in here. Seriously, right there it is. See, that right there. That sets here all the time. I've gotten it. I didn't get it that good, but that one time, but I've gotten it a few times, just not as good, so I never really recorded. You know, it's got to look something like this before I even record. You know, other than that, I feel like I'm just doing nothing. You know what I'm saying? Jeez, oh. You can tell where the objects are setting. One here. One there. Maybe one right there where that face is. Right there. See? Mouth. Nose. There's the eye. Another eye. So... I'm going to pause you for a second because my neighbor's leaving. I'm sure they'll have music going, so. Uh, I'm going to pause you for a second. <clears throat> Look at here. Look at that. See the curvature there? So, well, I don't know, folks. If they do the radio, I'll just cut it out of the video, so. Now, this, it also looks like a big cube right here. See how it goes down like that and then down? And then standing here watching, it goes that way and then back up. Like it's a square. So I'd imagine the cube is somewhere in here. And these tails here are starting to get more definition. Because see there? I've been recording eight minutes now. And you can still see the center there with the tail here and another tail here. So, but folks, I'm going to keep this short. Because it takes me two hours to download a 10 to 11 minute video. So, that's because I don't have internet. I do all videos with my phone. And it takes a long time. Really, it does. I mean, maybe one of these days we'll get internet, but I don't know when. Things are so hectic right now, you know, because I've got full custody of my grandkids, and it's just really hectic right now. But it's all right. The Lord provides. Which reminds me, folks, we need to really think about 
synchronizing our hearts and our minds to be one with God. Because really, things are going to happen. It's going to happen so fast that we ain't going to have time to repent more than likely. You know, and for those who don't watch, you know, I mean, Jesus says to, you know, signs in the sun, moon, and stars, and he says to be watchful. And if not, we will be passed by because he will come like a thief in the night. We won't even know he's been here. So the best thing we can do is watch. You know, I used to wonder why I do this. You know, and I just realized a couple months ago that, you know, I'm not really looking for planets. I'm looking, I'm looking for my Savior to return. That's what I'm looking for. You know, I'm looking for signs. You know, because he did say, look to the sun, moon, and stars. Well, this, uh, you know, not system is will cause everything that revelation tells us about as far as the weather and the uh, natural events that happens you know so like tonight you know it's this nebaru tonight video you know when i do a video during the day i call it like planet x today and then in my videos well that's why i call it uh, Planet X Nebiru update today. Unless the video is a couple days old. Then I usually say like Nebiru Planet X update. You know, just stuff like that. You know, and I, I use the word Nebiru and the word Planet X together. That way, whoever knows it as Planet X, well, then that's there. If they know it as Nebiru, then that's there. You, you see what I'm saying? It's basically so no confusion. Look at that straight line right there. See there? And then the yellow. And the white right there. And there's more white over here. See the, how it's purplish over here? But yet red and yellow here. Well, the red and the yellow, I think that's from the red planet known as a, a Saturn with the yellow moon. And over here, it's the purple and the white because that's the purple planet at two with its white moon. It makes a lot of sense, you know what I mean? The colors are important. And then look at this. See there? I mean, we're not to look for no little dots. By the sun. Oh no, they're, they're bigger than that. But can we have stuff like that? Close to Earth without a pole shift? Technically, no. But if you check the poles, they're moving faster than ever before. They've already changed the instruments that they use to measure the poles. They've already... They've been wondering for the last few years, why are they moving so fast? Well, it's because of this planet system. But they don't want to say nothing. They're not going to say nothing. Look right there. See there? And... They're going to blame it all on climate change. But we all know climate change is a bunch of bull crap. You know, it's so some politicians can get rich, like Al Gore, for one. He made, man, Al Gore from this climate change, he made enough money to where he could live three lifetimes and not have to worry about anything. He made that much. And it's kind of ironic, though, but he did it. So, I don't know. But uh, anyway, folks, I am going to let y'all go now. So, you know, like I was saying, give your mind, put your mind in your heart as one with God. Synchronize them. Get your thinking straight. You know, get your mind right. Get it set. Because it ain't going to be long now. Not long at all, folks. Now look at this. Ugh, this is actually curving around. See that? There's something going on here. So, 
That's the first time I've seen this curvature like this. See? I mean, I know y'all can see this. See? It comes down and around. See? So, I'll keep an eye on that. So, if I get anything good, I'll put it at the beginning of this video if you've watched this far. So, but I will say peace and love always. Thank you for watching. Nebaru Planet X update today. I'm Roger Paul. Don't forget, you can uh, use anything on this channel. You know, if I put it up, you're a subscriber, it's yours too. But please, you know, no bashing. Fact is, if you don't like the videos, go to, a, you know, go to look up videos that you like more. You know, I'm not trying to be rude. Believe me, I'm not rude. I'm never rude. But, you know, I love you all. I really do. And, again, thank you for watching. Roger Paul Channel. God bless you, everybody.